Hi guys, um, here on a uh, no cooling call. Um, we got a tap in, which is a Nordine gas furnace and a uh, matching heat pump outside. Um, we just got done putting about three pounds of uh, R410A in to get this thing up to about nine degrees of subcooling. So I'm checking temperatures now. Just want to see where I'm at. And um, we'll be um, checking for um, a leak here real soon. So um, It's 66 degrees out, which isn't doesn't seem too terribly cold, but um, but the house is up to about 85. So um, see what our return temperature is, and uh, uh, what it was doing. Actually, I could see in here. I wish I got a shot of it, um, but you could look in here and see the cap tubes coming off of the TXV. Um, it was coming in just fine as soon as it hits the TXV and on the other side of the TXV it was all ice up, iced up so that's a real good sign right off the bat that you got a low charge um, without even having any gauges on there or anything um, but we got our gauges on there and figured up what our subcooling was and um, went from there so um, I did not install this. This is just a service call. Um, so we'll go outside again and check what our pressures are doing, see where the subcooling's at. I wanted to give it a few minutes to even out and see where we're at. Um, read that or not. So right now I'm not extremely happy with my temperature drop um, <clears throat> so I guess we'll go out there and see what we got um, I'll be right back here we're back outside guys I just wanted to show you this one thing I found down in this little well this is almost too weird Appears to be a big old crawl dad. We're like, you know, a good 10 miles from the closest creek. Okay, anyhow, strange. Okay, my uh, clamp on temperature gauge is broken, so zip tie. The end of this guy seems to be working just fine. Andrew's there. Where am I at? Two seventy-five. Let me check that out. All right. According to our super cool slide rule, here on um, sub cooling with the TXV. Uh, this unit says it requires 10 degrees subcooling, so I set 410A to 275. My required subcooling, B, is 10. So my required liquid line temperature should be 80 degrees. it or not 80.8 point nine 81 okay well it's climbing so I'm gonna sit there and monitor this for a minute but um, it's looking like we're pretty good 
All right, guys. So, um, put just over about three and a half pounds in this thing. So, um, I'm gonna go inside and look for a leak, and um, I think I know where it might be coming from. I found an oily spot in there, and then Nordine coils for quite a while had a, uh, a big problem where the liquid line connected. They have that nut that connects on to the um, to the TXV uh, I had a bad problem with them leaking there so if I find something you'll see if not talk to you later bye